Um, we have another AI uh, bit of news. The Mid Journey devs got. F uh, so, uh, this is a weird developing story that's been happening. Uh, basically, the developers of Mid Journey, uh, it turned out, were laundering and creating a database of artists to train Mid Journey off of, which has been submitted into evidence for an outstanding lawsuit, right? Um, and a significant amount of these artists uh, came from Magic the Gathering. Like, it, it turns out that Magic the Gathering uh, just, like, had a huge compendium of art and artists just by virtue of how it works. And uh, so they scraped all the names and just trained off them, right? But they did this without, like, discerning which artists they should train off of. So that data set includes a few literal children who drew art as part of, like, a thing they did where they went to a children's hospital and asked sick kids to draw art, which they then scanned onto individual cards and then sent the proceeds to a hospital. So this, like... Metalwork Colossus drawn by, like, a dying child is now personally a, a part of Mid-Journey Forever. It's wonderful. It's like, could you imagine a better scenario than I have been stealing from ill child? It's great. It's so good. Uh, this scenario, by oh, it also included, you know, Mark Rosewater, who drew exactly one uh <laughs> the uh the play testing cards it's it's so good um oh man it's just amazing he drew two. Oh, did he draw another one this by the way these were so cool let me see if i can find it so um what they did was I, I loved these. They not only uh, got kids to do one and they released ones with these little kids drawings, but then they gave them back to their on-staff artists and were like, can you interpret a version of this card that does look like this? And they would. There's a bunch of these that look like this, like these big fantastical interpretations of child's drawings. This one's cute. Uh, there's a Crater Hoof Behemoth that is actually the best version of the card. Let me see if I can find it. So this is what... Crater Hoof Behemoth usually looks like. Uh, it's just a big fucking guy. Um, let me see if I can find the, ch the kid's drawing. This is the Crater Hoof Behemoth that the child made. Uh, it looks a little different. And then this is the, uh, this is the interpretation. <laughs> it's, it's so cute. <laughs> it's adorable. This is unfortunately this is peak. And the best part about this one is that this this is one of those cards that as soon as it enters the battlefield, uh, you win immediately. <laughs> like this is the card that just wins you the game on the spot. Oh, look up the Birds of Paradise child one. Okay, um I didn't know they did one. Let me check. Oh, this is adorable. These are actually really sick. Oh, oh, that's, that's, that's really good. Oh, <laughs> that's nice. I actually kind of like the one on the right for this one. And I do like, they put their ages under there. So it says, uh, Eli age eight. And this one says Andrea Raddick age 35. <laughs> this one is, they did what they could. <laughs> The Sliver Legion that's, like, fucked up, I love it. <laughs> it's, like, just not what a Sliver looks like. Who cares? It's adorable. Ugh. 